Hello again, George Weidland here from the University of Minnesota. I'm interested in documenting, describing, uh, and understanding the, the evolutionary history of, of biodiversity. It's led me over time to take an interest in informatics. And I have uh, illustrated with this flow diagram uh, a, a path through various scales at which uh, I um, am working. I didn't start at the global scale. I started kind of up in the upper right corner studying plant insect interactions. Uh, but uh, a number of years ago, after extensive field work on the island of New Guinea, I brought uh, the uh, study of long term large scale forest dynamics to the island of New Guinea. And uh, we are one of uh, 40 sites in the Forest Geo Network, Global Earth Observatories Network, that uh, is a, uh, an effort to uh, measure uh, change in forest composition and structure over time. This is a view of our 50 hectare plot in Papua New Guinea, where we measured and mapped and identified the species of about 300 individual stems, uh, and comprising about 500 species of tropical trees. We can drill down into their individual distributions at very local scales and examine how those are related to the micro environment uh, and drill from there into species interactions. Plants and insects uh, have uh, led me uh, to consider also the fungal endophytes that live within the foliage and how they may affect those interactions, which has led to uh, collaborations with uh, mycologists and uh, pharmaceutical chemists describing uh, novel secondary compounds that uh, show uh, anti-herbivore activity, but also, uh, in this case, uh, activity against tuberculosis, which might actually have some, some applied value. And all of this, uh, working across these scales, requires what's in the middle, which is uh, uh, the, to some, rather tedious subject of relational database design and development. If we're going to do quality science across scales, we're going to have to worry about uh, things like uh, data integrity and data quality, which most of us don't really have much patience for. Uh, and uh, what this image shows is a relationship among tables. We could probably put everyone in this room into a different table. And our goal here is can we uh, connect in uh, meaningful ways. Thank you.